As far as what a haircut means to me is, I feel like it's another line of defense of your hygiene. You know what I'm saying? It's like, it shows how much you care about yourself. And I feel like the first thing in life you should always do is care about yourself, love yourself, because if you don't love yourself, you can't love nobody else. So I feel like it's a very hard point for me. <laughs> but um, yeah, as far as young men, I feel like it's super, super important, super important because that, again, your appearance is the first thing that's judged, so you should care about yourself and your appearance. In a black community, hair is way more than just hair. Like, if you see, like, a woman, they cut their hair off, they're going to cry most of the time. They're going to cry because it's their hair. Like, if I had to cut my hair off, I would, I would cry. I would cry. What's wrong with my hair? It's not done. I'd be like, mm, I don't really want to do anything. I don't really want to dress up for real like I'm not gonna lie. I dress according to my hairstyle well I know that hair has been a statement for a long time especially in the black community you know hair is not just like hair itself it's a form of art it's like speaks to the culture it kind of goes for who we are you know I feel like it's a big statement I'm, I'm more for freedom of expression uh, as far as when it comes to black hair I think we've been deprived of being able to uh, really be able to uh, express uh, our roots and styles that really help our hair stay healthy. So I'm all for it. I, uh, I appreciate all the locks, all the braids. I think, it's, I think it's good for the black community to be able to jump into something like that. I would say definitely be you. Do not get discouraged. Always pick whatever you like. Don't let anybody tell you that whatever you're doing or whatever you like is not cute, it's not in, because at the end of the day, it's you and the day got to end. So, do you.